Welcome back everybody. So in this video here we are going to be working on how to make choices in general, okay? We're not going to be looking at how to make choices fully matter, but we're going to talk about making choices in general and making a little scene per choice, okay? So if you guys do not remember, I'm making these short little videos, Renpai videos, while I'm gone. I've moved out of the country for a year. So that's why this video game is called 12 months. It's actually the first part of my game that I have put out already. It's free if you want to download the whole game. But uh, we're going to be taking a look through that script for the first scene because there's so many different things that happen. And we're going to make sure that we try to recreate it as best as we can. Uh, I'm not going to go back to the original script, so I'm just trying to do it from memory and what I have. But uh, I hope to get all that stuff for you guys and make it interesting. So our spot that we need to add a choice is right here where LeVar is asking Squishy if we should pounce, okay? So I'm gonna actually take away the game screen for a second. We will bring it back up later, but for right now, we're just gonna have this. Now, making a choice is very easy. You're just gonna type the, uh, you're gonna type in the word menu, no capital, menu, colon, enter. Okay, so now we have it. I'm gonna now give you guys a little bit of a hint on how to do something as well. Maybe we want to have the question asked for that menu in the menu itself. So, and I'll show you what I mean by this after we're done. So we're gonna cut this part out. We're gonna add it to the menu here. This menu, anytime you have a menu, it should indent your line. It won't indent it for everything because you don't want to do it for everything. Everything that you have indented basically is per scene kind of thing. So you want to kind of think of it that way is that this is all part of the same scene. When we're doing with this it's going to be part of different like a different scene kind of thing. So what are we going to do? Are we going to pounce on him? Or are we not going to pounce on him? And I actually have the script because we took it out yet last time in the last video. I have the script already saved, so we're going to work on getting that put in. Just give me one quick second. Uh, copy. Paste. The indent is going to be all over the place, but uh, give me a quick second for it. So your answer is going to be on the same line as the question you've asked. We're going to indent this by highlighting the whole thing and hitting tab. We are now at the correct indent for everything, but because there's a colon at the end of here, it's going to indent it again. So this means that this here is connected to this choice. We'll indent it again. Highlight. Indent. Okay? So I don't have the characters with their mouths opening and closing for this one. I'm not going to do that right now. I'll probably do that off screen for you guys because it's not overly important and it doesn't have anything to do with what we're talking about today. That was in the last video, so we'll just set that up. Uh, you'll see it in the next video. Okay, that is really about it. As much as I can really show you guys, that's how you make it. And we're going to take a quick look at how it actually looks in the game. So you can see the script here. Very simple, very easy to do. We're going to go save. So this is the choice, and then this is what happens after that choice. So if you click this on the choice, you're not going to see this part here. So you can make this as long as you want. You can have a whole other scene in here if you want. In this case, we're sticking to something short because that's what's already in my game. And uh, so yeah, we're going to have it that way. Um, so yeah. We are going to now try this out in our game, and I will show you guys the game. Let's start the game. Remember, we're still working on all these. There's going to be... Uh, we're going to show timer with things as well. Uh, also, this game is made in a bigger window than the original game, so LeVar looks much tinier in the corner there. That's okay. So we talked about all this stuff in the last video that I did, moving the characters in and out and having the characters and pictures on the screen. We talked about all that. Um, yeah. So we're going to get to where we have our first question. So here we go. 
So if we wanted to, we could have had LeVar ask the question here and then click here. There would show up nothing down here and it would just be the choices here. But because we decided to put, let me highlight it for you guys. We decided to put this underneath, then it's going to show up under like while the menu is showing up on the screen. So you can choose which one you want to do. And in this case, let's say yes, do it. Why not? Okay, again, like I said, I don't have the mouth moving or anything like that for it, but that's how you do it, okay? So we had a little scene there that you wouldn't have got if you picked the other choice. So let's pick the other choice. Oops, go back too far. No, be nice to your brother. So it's a little different based on what choice you have. Now again, you can make this totally different. Maybe you choose something and it changes the whole scene. We're not going to do that in this case. I hope that this just makes sense on its own and we don't have to make any major changes here. You guys hopefully understand this much. Um, I'm going to be doing other videos. We're going to talk about making a choice that is remembered later on in the game in the next video, which will come out next month. So I hope you guys watch for that one. If you guys want to see any of my other Renpai videos, I do a lot more other stuff. If you guys are looking for a little bit more advanced stuff, there is definitely way more advanced than this video here. You guys can check out my playlist for Renpai, and I hope that you guys will be around for some other future Renpai videos with me as we recreate this scene in uh, my game, Lavar's Life. So... Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the, the next video. Bye-bye.